What's going on, you guys? I'm here at YCS Fort Worth. Yes. I'm here with my brother Johnny. You already know our team enforcers. What's everybody's up? everybody's in the building. Everybody. Even Deuce. Howdy. And I'm here with the one and only Mr. Simon. It's been too many events, but great to see you. Another top. How do we do this time in Dallas? Uh, I went. I started two wins and two losses by round four. And then I went 7-0 um, after that, made top 32, and then lost the top 32 to time. It's pretty decent, it's okay. Still on strikers? Yeah, I think it's gonna be the last time. But actually, before we begin, I'm gonna try something. I'm gonna do something. Okay, so. So if you're fans of him and him, I've been trying to get this guy to go to oh, MCM, YCS London, for so long. So if you don't know, YCS in London is probably the best YCS because it's, the Comic Con is there as well. So he's going to get you a lot of good content. So if you're a fan of Slim, leave a comment and tell him to go. You can carry on. You're fucked. You're fucked. You're going. You're definitely going. Got him. So anyway, the Death Robot doesn't even matter now. The Death Robot don't matter. That is the Back to our regular. Back to the regular. Yeah. It hasn't changed that much since Ghent, which was like two weeks ago. Yeah. So um, there's a few changes. I'll explain. I mean, Ray, we don't need to explain. Free Ash, we don't need to explain. So the DD Crow is uh, there's a lot of Orcas. I expected so many Orcas, and um, it's okay for the mirror match. Um, it's good for Salad. The only thing that's not good against is Thunder Dragon, and um, I'm very lucky to have not played any because. Uh, with the deck that's built, I would lose instantly if I play against them. Unless I have like there can only be one and stuff like that. So because of Azafot, um, this is much better than things like Bell. You can just use it almost any time. And yeah, free Widow, free Engage, free Area. I still think this is correct. Some people um, use two, but when you're going first and you have to go first sometimes if you're against Luna, you can't just choose second then you need as many things to potentially get into Ray. So if you reduce this, then you reduce the combinations that you could potentially have to go into Ray in your turn one. Um, the one-offs are Hercules Space, Multi-Roll, the Wind Condition, um, Afterburners, Hornet Drones, Jammer, and two Shark Cannon. Uh, I played only two Cosmics, so it was really difficult to decide because I really wanted to play free. But um, I wanted a jamming wave because um, even though it's not very good against Orcus, the like the mirror is very good against this Rogue Magic is good against, and just having that one extra Sky uh, Sky Striker spell means that you don't break as much if you use areas, and that's quite important. And because I'm not playing Eagle Booster as well, Eagle Booster is kind of not that great at the moment, especially against Orcus. Um, I had to have like at least jamming wave. So everything was like built towards Orcus and. At the beginning, I didn't face any until like the last round of day one. So my matchups versus other decks were slightly weaker and it made me lose, sort of made me lose like quite early on. It was kind of a risk, but I played quite a lot of Orcas later on. Um, two goods, one fusion, two desires is necessary for going first. It's not great, but like you, you kind of need it for going first. One upstart, one terraforming, one rotor, and three impermanence. And free deck number one. This this card is just way too good right now. You have to play free. This is basically a winning condition against like most versions of Orcus, pure Orcus, and Funny Dragon, and Salad. Let's do extra. One Phoenix, one Kagari, three Shizuku, three Hayate, one Kaina, Ingersu, Orso, Hita. Appaloosa, this guy is not good. It was better when I played it against because I had Eagle Booster. So sometimes you, you make a push, but you can't finish them. Like with, and I was playing Mind Control as well. With like Mind Control, um, Hornet Drones, Widow Anchor, um, Shark Cannon, you make a push, you do big damage, you end up on him, and then you hopefully have more to roll, bring back Eagle Booster, and that's like game pretty much against like Thunder, against Pure Orcus, against Lunar Orcus, just not against Cyber Orcus. Um, but right now I'm not playing. Um, Eagle Booster, so people can just run over this if you make it. So this could have been top uh, Topological Bomber Dragon. Um, one Starving Venom for the Super Poly, and one Chimera. I, I honestly thought that I was going to take this out, because the, the extra deck space was really tight again. Because I thought that 
people would play around this. They would expect Pe Striker to main deck this. The Striker is the one of the only decks in the um, in the top of the meta that can main this. And I thought people would just, if they go first, they would use Infinity to suck up Dengursu, so you can't make this. Um, fortunately, I didn't face any Cyber Orcus, so I'm not sure what they would have done. Sardek is one system down for Pure Orcus, Cyber Orcus. Uh, free Shared Ride. So for the Mirror, obviously, and sometimes for going first against um, Cyber Orcus, it's okay. They search quite a decent amount for going first against Salad. is really good as well. The Sanctum. So this was Summer Limit two weeks ago. But because like everyone's playing Cosmic and Twin Twister and it's and have Deck and Only One, you don't want them to sort of Twin Twister your Summer Limit and Deck and Only One in like a combo match. You basically just lose. If you if they do that on this, then you get to potentially pop a card and bring out Scythe, which is if you stall for a turn, that's basically game. Uh, three Lancia, one Scythe, two twins, to, to, uh, twins for Rogue and Mirror, and two Super Volley. Yeah. Anything you change to the side? Or it's you, really I mean, tight. You like built it, you built it, like you said, four Orcus. Yeah. yeah. So, so it's you, kinda, I guess you would say event dependent, format dependent. Very, very much so. I expected America to have a lot more combo. I, I thought Americans like combo more, so I thought there'd be a lot more Orcus. And I think there are. I just didn't face as many at the beginning that I thought I would. Um, I didn't have Bell this time. I still think Bell's quite a good hand trap overall, but there was just no space. I mean, like like I said, if, if I didn't have Bell, if I play, played pure Thunder, I must I must have a really huge uh, disadvantage. So just before I go, I'd like to give like a shout out to that guy over there. Oh, yeah. 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 Hey. <laughs> He's my trouble buddy. He's helping me out a lot. So venture. <laughs> I'm um, uh, to TCG Collectibles, my team currently, and um, they've been helping me a lot, and really good team. How many times has it been now you've been back? <laughs> Since been back? I think, I think seven now. I think seven. Now. It's back on a roll. I just want the win. <laughs> it's coming, man. It's coming. Yeah. Right, well, Thanks, Lynn. Thank Thanks, guys. Always. Hopefully, I'll see you. I think now I have to. Yeah, you have to get. You have no choice now. Your army's gonna. <laughs> Cheers.